I, I don't edit my videos, so if, if you have a problem with me saying, um, occasionally, hello baby, or stalling, move on. <laughs> okay, my rabbits are not eaten. They are loved, and that's why they're sit he's sitting here, or she's sitting here, very gentle. Let me see that I've sheared the her top half, and now I'll start going around with scissors just because I can tip the scissors and not um, run the risk of nicking her where her legs and things are starting to go. So I wanted people to see that, that are thinking about Angora rabbits. If you handle them often enough, I mean, I pet them every day, I feed them, and I handle them, snuggle them a lot when they're babies, and snuggle them a lot if they've given birth. There's your face, or your nose, where's your eyes? And they're quite gentle. I, well, yeah. They're just, my rabbits don't bite. If if it did bite, I would let it run the pastures in our farm because I can't have biting animals. I've got seven grandchildren living on our property. Okay, so then what I do, if you can see, I'll run where I could feel the body and then tip the scissors up. Now this won't give you the, the super smooth clip, but my concern is the bunny I can alter my spinning techniques for the fiber given. I am shearing, not plucking, because it is winter time here, and I do not want my baby to be left naked. If the wet temperatures drop low enough, I'll make her and her kits, well, not her kits, they're, baby, they're toddlers now, <laughs> um, fleece jackets tonight. I just saw a tube and cut out holes and and they've got jackets. So there I wanted you to see, yes, I, I moved her with her ears, but I didn't move her body. My other hand was holding her body. I don't lift a rabbit by their ears. I would not do that. People have thought I d did that in the past. I don't do that. I love my bunnies. None have ever died um, unnatural causes like broken necks or whatnot, but I may hold them still by the ear so that they don't kick and hurt themselves because I've got scissors near them or so that they don't jump off of me and break their back. There are some things that are safety precautions. You hold the rabbit's skin very taut because otherwise folds can get caught up in the neck. I have about 20 bunnies. I do this when I see bunnies starting to mat. I don't have a regular schedule like every three months. I just do it when they, when they look like they're starting to mat. I'll brush this and if it, the tangled ends, um, I know, the tangled ends brush out, then great. If they don't, then they will become, actually what I do is I put them in pillowcases and put them on top of the cages so they stay, it's got insulation. So, there you go. I want you to see that they can be very easy to handle. You just need to do it often enough that they're not afraid of you or that the sound of clippers are frightening. I'll go take this wool and go spin it now. Bye-bye.